privilege today to uh, get an opportunity to come and test and shoot this, this beautiful white pointer Pro Sportsman 840. I've had a bit of a relationship with this boat. I know that it was built from the keel up to go and catch big game fish. That's, that's its primary role. Uh, it, it's, it's a custom built boat out of a good manufacturer in Gisborne, White Pointer Boats, who, who have a history of building very, very good commercial boats and some very, very good recreational boats. In my mind, this is the best one I've seen out of that factory. Its pedigree as a game fishing boat is, is already proven. It's done 200 hours. It's caught 12 billfish, mostly in the Pacific Islands. Uh, won a couple of tournaments up there. It's heavy, but it's got enough horsepower to really manoeuvre. So it, I, I found, as we've been driving it, it's stable when you're accelerating and, and trying to manoeuvre the boat. As, as you would if you were driving on a fish, uh, which is very, very important, and it goes exactly where you point it, so super predictable. Here we are at the helm of uh, this white pointer 840, uh, known as the girlfriend for a pretty good reason. She'd definitely be my mistress, I'd be happy with that. The electronics package in this boat is absolutely state of the art. The very best of gear from Raymarine, E140W, hybrid touch technology. A lot of people are beginning to favour over conventional touch screens, a little bit easy to use in a seaway. This has literally everything. It's got the bird finding radar, it's got the very best sonar on board, really good unit. Coupled with the Raymarine ST70 autopilot, which is about as good as it gets. So yeah, everything's here. Hydraulic steering, super light on the helm, it's, it's literally your little fingers, all you need. Let go of the wheel, doesn't go anywhere. Here I am, kicking back on the um, all leather day bed. This is genuine leather in a trailer boat. Pretty nice. It's uh, all the way through the boat and I think it's an outstanding feature. Uh, and and what, what better place to sit, watch your lures for the day when it's a bit quiet. Uh, well, here we are in the business end of the girlfriend which is a statement in itself. We've got everything's here that you could want to go and, and catch the biggest fish you've ever seen. Something that you don't see on enough trailer boats. Uh, tuna tubes, one in here, bait tank. Looking at this transom door, it, it's a bit special. Lifts up nicely. Beautifully finished and, and also just beautifully machined. Everything, there's no, nothing catches or creaks or anything like that. Drop it back. Ladder in the water. Off you go for a swim. Fantastic. Uh, this cockpit is huge. The engine box has been moved forward. It gives you good walking space all the way around, which is really important. There's nothing worse than trying to get through the back here and tripping up and falling over. There's plenty of toe kick space here. What I mean by toe kick is you can actually get your knees against the back here. Your feet are under. They're not kind of pushing up against a plate. If they're pushing up against a plate, you tend to get pulled forward and pulled over which is not a good outcome for anyone. So this is a six cylinder engine powering a uh, Volvo Duroprop stern drive, uh, four blade on the back, three blade on the front. Revs out to around three and a half thousand RPM and uh, I had that trimmed out to about 38 knots on the way up, which is, which is not bad. Uh, very, very pleasant indeed, I must say. I like the way this one's um, set up as far as servicing is concerned. It is a bit tight around the engine, but you can get at the oil filters. Sea strainer right here too, which is important. Very important to be able to get at these things easily. Uh, really, you know, for what is a tight compartment, this is an easy engine to service. This is the roof of the girlfriend. Uh, not an area we normally pay a lot of attention to, but this one warrants it. But what's, to, what's of real interest to me is the quality of the paint finish. It is superb. It's not just the paint finish, it's the detail in the arrow thing, like all the corners are perfect, everything's been sanded back. Uh, good, you know, it's good sturdy bow rail, it's not overly high, it doesn't need to be, you're not going to come up here very often, but if you do, the gunnel's wide, there's no skid, no dramas if you have to. Really well thought out boat and built by people who know what it means to work on one. Up here forward in the cabin, uh, looks to be close to full length, certainly looks comfortable enough for me to spend a night here. But what to say about the girlfriend in conclusion? Uh, she's a white pointer pro sportsman 840. She's got 370 horsepower. She's got the best electronics money can buy. Certainly up there. Drives like a dream, 38 knots. Reverses beautifully, super maneuverable. Fantastic, I love her, she's, she's great. This white pointer pro sportsman 840 is potentially one of the best trailer boats I've ever been on. Full marks for white pointer.